Well, hello, everyone. We should be live now. This is my third uh, stream, actually. Okay, so what advice would I give someone getting bullied or made fun of? <clears throat> well, like if like if you're in school and, and you're being bullied, like I was, I was bullied as well. And honestly, the bullies a lot of time want a reaction out of you. The best thing you can do is try to avoid them. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Look, Simeona is a friend. A friend. Not a girlfriend. I'm not going to be having sex with her. Oh my goodness. Favorite body part? Mm, duh, the penis. Have you seduced anyone <laughs> recently? <laughs> sex. Oh no. <laughs> What is the profile picture of that? Oh my gosh! It's me! Like, the bears <laughs> Yes, the sexual altar is absolutely insane here. What would your last day be like? My last day alive? Oh my gosh, I don't know. I would say you need to try to, like, live each day as, like, as, like, it's your last. You really should, and it's like, how many people actually do that, you know? Do you make art? I would say pretty much anything is art. Like any everything that I that I work on is art. My my um every every everything I do is art. I just I just love art. I do love expressing creativity. Any advice on how to come out to family and friends? Think about how you want to tell your family and friends. Like if it's easier for you initially to like write a letter and perhaps read it to them or send it to them or just kind of give it to them and have them read it while, while you're there. There are so many ways you can do it. Um, but you really have to kind of, if you really want to do it, you really have to kind of step up and just do it. You have to take that chance no matter how difficult it, it may be. How often do you buy new makeup? <laughs> I've been using the same makeup for five plus years. Is that your real hair? Yes, this is, this is my real hair. This is not fake, as you can see. It's all real. All real hair. It's very, very long. Goes down to my, to my beauty. Do you want SRS? Yeah, oh yeah, I want it so, so bad. I want it so bad that I already had it done many, many years ago. Okay, can you tell me to go, go to a therapist already? <laughs> well, look, it can be scary going to a therapist, absolutely, because it's like, you feel like, like you're exposing like every, every everything. Like you're just kind of having a hard time with something and you're, you're scared about revealing things about yourself. And then you're, you're, you're afraid of some kind of judgment someone, this other person may have. And honestly, it's, once you kind of get past that phase and you can actually trust your therapist, it gets so much more, it, it becomes so much more more comfortable. It's just that initial phase that can be really difficult. And it was very difficult for me initially. It really was. Des, right. Do you think social media and access to uncredible information is, ben, uh, is a benefit or hindrance on the progress in meeting people's mental health challenges? Well, <laughs> social media provides a lot of, as you said, uncredited information. People share things. Like, if you're on Facebook and you're just scrolling down your, your timeline of what your friend shared, and then it, it has an uh, article head, headline of, of anything, you know, not just m mental health related, you just read that headline and you automatically think it's true. And, th and then you go to it and you read it and you think it's true without looking up any other information. So it can be extremely damaging, yes. Panski, panty panski. Do you miss the convenience of having a penis? Some sometimes I I miss the little te little ding, ding dong, so, little, little little baby ding dong. <laughs> she lives in New Jersey. I live, I live in Arizona. <laughs> okay, how do you handle flaky people? Um, 
put a whole bunch of cornflakes on them, put some milk on them, and eat them with a spoon. Yeah. Mm. Sexual altar. Sexual altar is just it's, it's insane tonight. It's amazing. <laughs> she is just on top. I swear pumpkins. And look, if I had a pumpkin right now, it would be, I have one up, up, up there. But it's not square, it's circular. So you need to say circular pumpkins. Circular pumpkins, there you go. A dog. That would be a challenge to seduce. Oh, come on, you can't be kidding. You had to be serious about this. If, if you have a profile called sexual altar, you had to be serious. You can seduce animals, come on. Circular pumpkins. If you're gonna pursue your, your, your dream, I would recommend figuring out what the best what the best way of being able to accomplish this, this dream is? How can you make money from this dream? So if, if you can really find a way to, to make some money off of it, but can still consider it like your, your dream job, not really like a career, but just something that you just really love doing. So you really need to be very careful about what you decide to do. Triangular pumpkins, rectangular pumpkins, smashed in pumpkins. <laughs> oh my gosh, are people hexagonal pumpkins? Transformers pumpkin butts. Pies in disguise. Ooh, pumpkin pie. Well, hello, lady loser. That's right. Can you make my day and say my name? Say my name. Say my name. Say my name. Like Destiny's Child says. Why don't you say my name? Oh, the snow is going to be so bad in New York. You live in New Jersey. You know it's snowing. <laughs> Look, I do not know it's snowing. I live in Arizona. Oh my gosh, you guys. Desiree. What do you think of the recent PewDiePie controversy? Well, <laughs> it goes to show, you know, fake news, fake media. It's all true. You know, they all they all put out these fake stories for head headlines, for revenue. I mean, they write all these fake stories about so many things, PewDiePie included, wrote, wrote these, he wrote these, um, they wrote these fake stories about PewDiePie. And it literally is, it is, it is fake news stories. So, you know, I mean, it, 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 it cost them, it cost them deals and, and stuff, but what do you expect when you have scumbag writers on these failing um, news media, the failing, the failing news uh, medias that are dying? You know, it's just, the thing is, if you want a lot of people to view your site, to subscribe to your content, to pay so you can get ad revenue. You're going to write a very juicy story that's clickbait, that has the wrong title, that's made up a bunch of garbage. So that's what's happened. You know, I have, I have, I never trust the, the mainstream media because they're just a bunch of garbage. Bunch of garbage. You say like, oh, I live in the secret location, yet you literally said, you live in between Philly and New York City. Did I? Proof. I need proof. I need P-R-O-O -O Arizona. I have only ever seduced in New Jersey. It's just the protector lying. Look, the sexual altar has seduced in all 50 states, in all countries, in the ocean, in the sky, in space, on other planets, the sexual altar cannot be stopped. She cannot be stopped. Have you <laughs> have you ever used CBD to seduce? How can you not? CBD is excellent for, for, for seducing. You wanna see something scary? <sighs> that was creepy, I know, right? <laughs> what part of Arizona are you from? I'm, I'm from whatever part is the hottest. How hot is Arizona right now? Um, let's see. Temperature in Arizona. It is 91 degrees Fahrenheit, 33 degrees, 33 degrees Celsius. So that's how hot it is here. 
She is looking it up because she lives in New Jersey. Shh, keep it down, keep it down. You can the arms, the arms are very nice, and then twirls in circle, and you can see the pants, but they're just black, so. Huh. Fascinating, I never knew that. That was a, that was a quote from what I said? Oh my gosh, I'm crazy. Will you seduce your <laughs> grandma and they're coming on her? No, <laughs> no. Would you ever seduce Donald Trump? I mean, come on. How can he not be seduced? What should we think about your ties to the alt-right? Okay, look, this is the third time I've heard this. I'm just gonna expose it, okay? Honestly, look, Here, here's the thing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fill you in on this big, huge secret, okay? My ties are that 